Hi everyone, Bill Nye here. Have you ever wondered where the electricity comes from that powers your favorite video games and lights up your home? It's all thanks to energy. Energy makes things move and work. There are different types of energy sources, just like there are different types of fruits. Some energy sources are like apples. We can find them easily, but they might not last forever. These are called non-renewable energy sources. Other energy sources are like the sun. They keep giving us energy day after day. We call these renewable energy sources. They're like our energy friends that will always be there for us. In this awesome adventure, we'll explore the amazing world of renewable energy and learn how it can help us create a brighter future for everyone. Before we get stuck in, remember to check out our websites at Starbeck Education and Wild Goose Education for some amazing educational resources for Key Stage 1 and 2. Let's start with the biggest energy source in our solar system, the Sun. The Sun is like a giant ball of fire. But did you know it's not actually burning? It's powered by something called nuclear fusion which is a fancy way of saying it creates a whole lot of energy. Solar energy is the energy we get directly from the sun's rays. We can use this energy to power our homes, schools and even cars. How do we capture the sun's energy? With solar panels, of course, solar panels are like giant energy sponges that soak up sunlight and turn it into electricity. It's like magic, but with science. Next up, let's talk about wind energy. Have you ever felt the wind blowing through your hair? That's the power of moving air and we can use it to generate electricity. Wind turbines are like giant pinwheels that spin when the wind blows. As the blades turn, they power a generator that makes electricity. Wind energy is a clean and sustainable way to power our world because it doesn't pollute the air like some other energy sources do. Water is essential for life, but did you know it can also generate electricity? That's right, it's called hydropower. Hydropower plants use the energy of flowing water to spin turbines, just like wind turbines. Dams are often built to create reservoirs of water, and when the water is released, it rushes through the turbines and generates power. Hydropower is a powerful and reliable source of renewable energy, especially in areas with lots of rivers and rainfall. Section five. Earth's hidden treasures, geothermal energy. Now, let's dig deep into the Earth and discover the power of geothermal energy. Geothermal energy comes from the heat deep inside our planet. Geothermal power plants use this heat to generate electricity. It's like having a giant natural boiler beneath our feet. Geothermal energy is a clean and sustainable energy source that can power our homes and businesses. Section six, nature's fuel bioenergy. Did you know we can even make energy from plants and other organic materials? It's called bioenergy. Bioenergy uses organic matter, such as wood, crops, and even manure to create energy. One example of bioenergy is using corn to make ethanol, a type of fuel that can power cars. Bioenergy is a renewable energy source because we can grow more plants and organic matter. Section seven, why renewable energy rocks? Renewable energy sources are like superheroes for our planet. Here's why they're clean and green. Renewable energy sources don't produce harmful pollution that can harm our air, water and climate. They're sustainable. Renewable energy sources are like gifts that keep on giving. They won't run out like fossil fuels, which are non-renewable energy sources. They create jobs. As we transition to a cleaner energy future, we'll need more people to design, build and maintain renewable energy systems, creating new job opportunities. Section 8. Renewable energy versus fossil fuels. A friendly matchup. Renewable energy sources are like the new kids on the block, challenging the old ways of getting energy from fossil fuels. Fossil fuels like coal, oil and natural gas have been our main energy sources for a long time, but they come with some big problems. Fossil fuels release harmful pollutants into the air when burned, contributing to climate change and air pollution. They're also non-renewable, meaning they'll eventually run out. Renewable energy sources are like the clean and sustainable alternative to fossil fuels, helping us create a healthier and brighter future. Section nine, fun with renewable energy, quizzes and experiments. Now it's time for some fun. Test your knowledge about renewable energy with this quick quiz. What type of energy do solar panels collect? What makes wind turbines spin? 
Where does geothermal energy come from? You can also try this simple experiment at home to see renewable energy in action. Make a mini solar oven. The materials you need are a cardboard box, aluminum foil, plastic wrap, black construction paper tape, and a warm sunny day. Instructions. 1. Line the inside of the box with aluminum foil. 1. Cut a flap in the top of the box and cover it with plastic wrap. 1. Place black construction paper on the bottom of the box. 1. Set your solar oven in a sunny spot and see how it absorbs heat from the sun. Section 10. Power up the future. What you can do. You can be a renewable energy superhero too. Here are some ways you can make a difference. Talk to your family about renewable energy. Share what you've learned and ask if you can explore ways to use more renewable energy at home. Conserve energy. Turn off lights when you leave a room. Unplug electronics when you're not using them and try to use less energy overall. Support renewable energy initiatives. Learn about renewable energy projects in your community and see how you can get involved. Remember, every little bit counts. By making smart choices and supporting renewable energy, we can create a cleaner, healthier and more sustainable future for generations to come.